Revision Management with Revit and ID8 BIMLINK. In this video, we'll review the revision management and sheet issuance tools within Revit, and then demonstrate how ID8 BIMLINK can be used to quickly and accurately coordinate this data within Excel, and then be pushed back into Revit via ID8 BIMLINK. Revit provides two separate but related tools for managing revisions. The first is the Revision Cloud, which is found on the Annotation tab. Love it or hate it, it's there to help us identify areas that have changed. BIMLINK owners have been able to access this information about the Revision Clouds since our 2013 version was released. This can be done by using the Revision Cloud link or by using the Sample link, shown here. There's not much you can edit with the Revision Clouds, so the primary benefit here is one of auditing. You can see in the Sample link that we can publish the sheet and view of each cloud so that it can be reviewed by the Project Manager. The second tool that supports revision management is the Revision tool found on the View tab. This tool can be used to manage not only your revisions, but also is used to control sheet issuances. This revision tool works hand-in-hand -hand with the Revisions on Sheet button found within the Sheet Properties. When the revision sequence is checked, as shown, it will update the revision schedule, which can be nested within the Title Block family. So, why use the Revision on Sheet Properties? Managing issue sets is perhaps the most compelling reason. Controlling the title block information is also a great way to communicate with the project team and reduces your liability. And lastly, you may find the revision clouds insufficient to reflect the true scope of the revision set. Let's take a look at how ID8 BIMLINK can be used to access these revision on sheet properties to expedite the issuance of an owner review set. With ID8 BIMLINK for Revit 2014, we have access to these sheet-based properties. We can create a new sheet-based link or use the out-of-the-box sample called Revision on Sheets, which is shown here. The revision properties will be labeled with the name that Revit gives them, which is a combination of the sequence number plus the revision description. After we export to Excel, we can have even a non-Revit user decide which sheets belong to the issue set by changing the values from false to true. Editing in Excel is so much easier than editing each Revit sheet individually. To complete the process, we save the file to Excel and then use the import option within BIMLINK. Select the file and then the worksheet. BIMLINK gives us important feedback about the changes we are about to make. After completing the import, all the sheet title blocks will correctly reflect their status with the date of the owner review documents. We've saved hours of time and now we're ready to publish the set. Editing sheet issue dates is easy with ID8 BIMLINK. To review, the workflow summary is to start with the out-of-the-box sample link, then export the data, next make the edits in Excel, and then import the changes back into Revit. Using BIMLINK to manage your revisions has several benefits. First, you'll be saving time. We all know that Excel is the quickest way to edit volumes of data, and additionally this method eliminates the need to open each sheet. The fact that you won't need to train your staff on the use of revision tools will also save you time. And lastly, this will reduce your liability through improved coordination of your revision data. You can download a free trial at our website. Give it a try. ID8 is an Autodesk authorized developer with 25 years of experience in software development with a specific focus on building information modeling. For complete information about ID8 BIMLINK, please visit our website at www.id8bimlink.com.